welcome back to rapid dentistry today we have a crucial topic to discuss that is anemia anemia is a disorder that affects millions of people worldwide and understanding it is very vital for both medical professionals and the general public in this video we will explore the causes symptoms diagnosis and treatment of anemia so let's dive right in what is anemia first things first what exactly is anemia Anemia is a condition in which the body lacks enough RBCs or hemoglobin to carry sufficient oxygen to the body's tissues. Hemoglobin is a protein in RBCs that binds to oxygen and transports it throughout the body. Now there are several causes of anemia and it's important to understand them. The most common causes include iron deficiency anemia that is the most common type of anemia and it is often caused by the lack of dietary iron. The second type is your vitamin deficiency anemia. Now deficiencies in vitamins like your B12 and folic acid can lead to anemia. The third cause is chronic diseases. Conditions like your CKD that is your chronic kidney disease or inflammation can affect RBC production. Now the fourth cause is your hemolytic anemia that is when the body destroys RBCs faster than it can make them. And the fifth cause is aplastic anemia. It is a rare type of anemia where the bone marrow uh, does not produce enough blood cells. Now, recognizing anemia is important. Now, the common symptoms include fatigue, that is feeling tired or weak, pale skin, that is due to reduced blood flow and oxygen, shortness of breath, that is essentially during the physical activity or exercise, dizziness and headache, from insufficient oxygen to the brain and your cold hands and feet due to poor circulation. Now if you suspect anemia, it's essential to seek medical advice. Diagnosis typically involves your blood test that is to measure the hemoglobin, RBC count and other parameters. Your second that is iron studies which is to determine the cause especially for your iron deficiency anemia. The third test is your bone marrow biopsy that is in some cases to investigate the cause further. Now the treatment of anemia depends on its cause. Common treatment include dietary changes that is for iron and vitamin deficiency anemia. Adjusting your diet may help. Now supplements, iron and vitamin B12 or folic acid supplements can be given. Now third would be medications that is your erythropoietin stimulating agents or corticosteroid in certain cases. Now the fourth is blood transfusions. In severe cases when the hemoglobin is critically low, we have to transfuse blood. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and if you have any questions or topics you'd like us to cover in future videos, please leave a comment below. Stay curious and keep learning. See you in my next video.